Well, here it is. You're actually in my garage. And this is a one-fifth scale hydraulic radio control loader. A wheel loader. I'm just in the middle of working on it right now. I bought this uh, from my friend Richard. He actually is an engineer and built this big, big, big machine. It weighs 500 pounds. <laughs> and it can lift 500 pounds. Now I've had this for a little while, but when Richard sold it to me, he let me know that the back axle actually had a broken gear. Here's the axle right here. You can see, unfortunately, that some of the teeth had snapped off of the gear. Now, Richard and I have been working on this. He's actually across the country. I've been working on it myself here once we got it shipped uh, to get a, a hardened steel um, uh, gear for the spool and a hardened steel pinion gear. Yep, that's a car jack. <laughs> I had to lift it up uh, to remove the axle and the differential, right? So here's the spool gear that goes inside the differential. The whole housing is downstairs in my shop right now. I've been working on it for about a week and a half. Really, really simple. Uh, a couple of plates to help everything. I'll get you on the inside here. This is actually a hydraulic valve block, all right? The pressure gauge is in the back. You can't quite see it from here. And then all the tubes that come out. Here we are. Here's the hydraulic tank, the pump, everything in there and it will go forward to the drive motor now this is the drive motor right here let's switch around the drive motor fits into the well it's not really a transmission it's just a, a, a power distribution block it is four-wheel drive they're locked diffs and the electronics box. Now the electronics box fits up in this cab right here. I know everyone's looking at my snowblower going, you should attach the snowblower to the front of this, but it doesn't really work that way. <laughs> and plus, I want uh, Richard probably to design me one for the front. Maybe a nice blower or something that can fit on the front. We'll see. We have to get this together first. I'm very excited to show you guys how it runs and how it gets together. Uh, but I'll tell you, a little bit more work. Uh, I should have the gears within a week or so. And uh, we'll be able to get this up and on the go. Maybe when it snows, I'll actually have something to use my snowblower on, plus my giant loader. <laughs> anyway, guys, I hope this tantalizes your fantasies of radio control addiction.